following are seven easy mobility drills that at most you'll need as a band. The first one I'm doing I call upper body flow. My hand is through the band as you can see in the video and it is attached to a pull-up bar. The biggest thing here and with pretty much everything we're doing is just scouring. So I'm constantly moving around trying to find various tight spots. I'm not really staying still for too long. I am rushing through. I would hold a little longer with a lot of these, but for the sake of making this video a little shorter, I only held for a few seconds, but you could hold easily 20 seconds plus, um, and then just scour around. If you're finding a spot that's really tight, you're going to want to spend a little more time as opposed to a spot that is not. So this next one I call band assisted hip mobility. Um, it's a Kelly Starrett type one. He calls it splits machine. He usually has the band up right below the chest. Um, I'm going around the waist here. Again, I'm scouring, searching, hunting, seeking, and destroying various tight spots. So I'm walking my hands forward, walking them back, going into a Cossack squat. There's really no wrong way to do it as long as you're just moving around and trying to find various spots that are tight for you, trying to get a little bit of a hip, fl hip flexor action going on here. Again, your imagination is the only thing that's going to hold you back. Just move around and see what needs attention for you. Generally, I'll do this in a mobility circuit or as part of a warm-up before a lower body or full body lift. The next exercise I'm doing is couch stretch using a bench. You can also do this on your couch at home while watching television. Your knee would be where your butt would normally be on a couch and the back of your foot would be where your head would be on the couch. From here, again, I'm raising my arm up, trying to find a little bit of uh, tightness in that lateral side. Um, from here, I'm going down to the floor, got my feet up on a wall, the closer your butt is to the wall, the deeper the stretch you're going to get. Um, again, awesome one to do while you're just watching TV, laying on the floor at home. Then I'm going into a deep squat, driving, um, flexing my adductors against the resistance of my hand, and then getting a little bit more mobility there. Here, I'm a little wider. If you have a better wall than I'm using, you can kind of almost go into like a sumo split type stance. The next exercise I'm doing is a figure four glute stretch. Using a countertop, you can use a table, a bar stool. Um, you could do this on the floor. You could also put your leg up on a bench and have your opposite knee on the floor. A lot of different ways to do that one. Um, from here, I'm going to uh, a band distracted ankle mobility drill. Key point on this one, you don't even need the box. Your foot could be on the floor, but what must happen is the banded leg heel must stay down. So I suction cup it down with my hands, and then I'm driving my knee forward, trying to get it up towards my toes, if not past. I'm going out with it, kind of get that knee out type position right now, um, and then just really driving the knee forward, trying to get uh, a little bit more ankle mobility, gaining some dorsiflexion there. Um, and then from here, I'm going into a deep squat. Again, another awesome exercise that involves no equipment. I'm just getting into a deep squat. Often, my goal is to hang out in this position for two minutes, um, making sure the back stays flat, feet as straight ahead as possible. And there you have seven mobility drills that at most you need as a band that will help guide you to better mobility.